Here's the question says the resistance of the meter bridge AB as given in figure is 4 ohm with a cell of EMF E is equal to 0 0.5 volt so this E is 0 0.5 volt and rheostat resistance RH is equal to 2 ohm so this RH is equal to 2 ohm the null point is obtained at some point J so this is the null point which we get in this first case then they say when the cell is replaced by another one of EMF E is equal to E2 so this cell is replaced by E S E2 the same null point J which is this is obtained or found for RH is equal to 6 ohm so this becomes a second case and both the cases the balancing length is same we are supposed to find the value of E2 yes if you remember for the EMF Whose, for the cell whose EMF is to be measured, let's take that formula E dash as E upon R plus R plus RAB into RAB by LAB into balancing length. So now if you pay attention, for both the cases, I can say the main cell remains the same. The wire resistances and the length remains the same the internal resistance is anyways a constant and the balancing length is also the same in fact there is no internal resistance mentioned over here so we can assume this to be zero so if i take the two cases i can say that e dash is changing from 0.5 to e2 and r the external resistance which over here is rh is changing from 2 to 6 that is the only change guys which means if I take the two cases and take the ratio of it the E RAB LAB and L everything in the ratio will get cats which means I can say E1 upon E2 is going to be equal to R2 plus 0 plus RAB upon R1 plus 0 plus RAB where R2 is the second case of rheostat resistance and R1 is the first case of the rheostat of the resistance that means if we substitute the values we get E1 is 0 0.5 E2 is unknown R2 is the second case of the rheostat resistance which is 6 plus RAB is 4 upon the R1 is the first case which is 2 plus RAB is still 4. So basically guys this is 0 0.5 upon E2 is equal to 10 upon 6. We can reduce this down to 5 upon 3. So when you cross multiply you get the value of E2 as 0 0.3 volt and that is your final answer.